all right guys so what's up so this is going to be a tutorial on how to do jumping stick to down spike uh here's an example of the trick all right so that was the trick right there uh once you have it down this is going to be an addicting trick that you're going to want to do always so I'm gonna teach you how to do it so the first thing you wanna learn is just practice doing a jumping stick slowly and catching it on down spike it's it's really important that you get this like memory motion down like that don't concentrate on the time of what it's doing just throw it up and try to catch it like that and get used to that get used to catching it like this and once you get used to catching like th like this then you can move on to the next part of the trick. The next part is whoa. The next part is when you're when you throw it up and you still haven't caught it, you're gonna have the tama you're gonna be holding the tama like this. And you're gonna throw the tama straight up like that. Don't do any turns with it, don't do anything to it. You're gonna try to keep it as straight as possible. It might spin like this or something, but that's alright. It even makes it easier. So just you're gonna throw it straight up. And then you're gonna grab this, and because you threw it straight up, you're gonna be able to track the hole because you're gonna be able to see it. And in that small amount of time, you can just go for the down spike. I'm gonna show you one more time in full motion here. Jumping stick, and then see how it, it, it was a little tilted like that for me, but it still try to keep it as straight as possible. So, see? just like that it helps a lot of you bend your knees it kind of makes it a little bit in slow motion if you if you bend your knees everything is a little tiny bit more in slow motion when you bend your knees so make sure you practice that so yeah make sure you look at the slow-mo what I'm doing and uh, yeah guys you can get this